These deranged counts always leave a spare key in the fish tank. It's a textbook case. Oops, well, at least the sunglasses are still intact and within reach. Great, now they're on the fan. Whoa! I might as well rearrange the furniture. Looks like a ladder to me. Great. Really great. Now I'm making an ass of myself. And that plant has my glasses. This flytrap obviously isn't a picky eater. <laughs> you can eat me when you have sunglasses in your mouth. I can't believe this. Now they're in the vase? I hate to do this. Sort of. True, a priceless collection of fine antiques and furniture may have been destroyed. But look who got a new pair of sunglasses! That was as easy as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hello, this is Ms. Fortune. Welcome to the CAT scan voice recognition system. If you are not an authorized user, I strongly suggest you nip this childish little prank in the bud before somebody gets hurt, namely you. Otherwise, please state your name at the tone. Lagnut. Voice pattern recognized. Welcome, Mr. That's it? I'm in? The old use helium to imitate a high voice henchman trick. It works every time. Yes, yes. It is all exactly as I had foreseen. Soon my master will obliterate the cutifier. Wait, what's this? King Hugh? In the sky? He's... Pursuing Flux wildly. He's angry. He plans to seize the cutifier. I must alert my master. Flux, now you have two lunatics on your tail. I've got to hurry. Maybe I should show someone how cool I look in my new shades. Hmm. Ah, an uninvited guest.
Hmm. Hmm. Anybody home? Here, kitty. Yes, master? Master? Did you call me master? Yes, master. This isn't one of your tricks, is it? I have no tricks, master. Only my boundless dedication to you. I only want to be of use to you, master. Huh. Now, this should be interesting. Miss Fortune. Yes, Master? There's somewhere I want you to go. I'd go to the ends of the world for you, my Master. Actually, the hallway outside will be fine. As you wish, Master. Okay, you really want to help me out? Stick one of your paws in that scanner slot. I live only to obey you, Master. Hey, thanks a million. And I really mean that. Now, scat. Scat? Scat, as in get lost. The last thing I need is some sleepwalking furball following me around. Lost. Yes, Master. Then again, I really would be crazy not to take advantage of this situation. Misfortune, I command that upon waking you will feel as if your fur is infested by a platoon of parasites. You will constantly itch in places you can never quite reach. Itch like an alley cat, as you wish, Master. When you see your pal Nefarious, or any of his lackeys, you will address them with only the foulest, most perverse gutter slang you can dredge up. No insult is too ugly or too crude. Ugly and crude. Yes, Master. As for myself and my friends, well, you'll have nothing but the nicest things to say to us. How's that sound? Fabulous, Master. I love what you've done with your hair. You catch on fast. Bye-bye, sweetheart. Have fun. Drew, you're a genius. Hello, power! Voila! Bingo! Eureka! Etc! All right, Nefarious. I have your warp device, and I know how to use it. Well, not really, but I'm sure I can figure something out.
Here it goes. Congratulations, uh, Mr. Blank. I was, of course, expecting you. Congratulations. Not necessary. I haven't seen such pathetic security since, well, since the last time I dealt with your henchmen. I have to admit, I expected more from you, Nefarious. Now say goodbye to your machine. Just a moment, Mr. Blank. Don't bother, Nefarious. There's nothing you can say. Nothing? Well, then answer me this. Why would you want to embark on this asinine little outing when I can simply send you back to your own world? No deal. I've heard enough. But, Mr. Blank, I'm only looking out for your best interests. Remember your unfortunate little run-in with my syringe? The clock is ticking. This may be your last chance. I don't need your help, Nefarious. I've already found your warp device, and now I'm gonna blow you right out of the skies! Go! I command you! I haven't finished! That machine faster. There you are, Nefarious. You too, Fluffy. Come on, come on. Almost there. Say goodnight. Yes. Hold on, Flux, little buddy. Hold on. <laughs> It's me! Fox! Well, howdy, hi, Franco! Fox! <laughs> now, where the hell did he go? <laughs> Give me, Flux. This is the only way. Huh? Where am I? Whoa! I'm flying! Flux? Where did you go, little buddy? Oh, is this fun or what? Fun! Oh, I'm vomiting to my dad! Oh, come on, you big sissy. Mautu never died from a little old fall. Although, I guess that doesn't help you much. Fox! It gets worse! The fire shot me full of beauty, Jenny! Any minute now, I'm going to turn into a tube! Even if the fall doesn't kill me, I'll be trapped here forever! Drew, you're doomed! Listen! I do have one hope! Ah! I stole this warp device from the forest and they sent me home. Oh, they may blow me up. To smithereens, either way, I'm going to have to use it. Now! Wait! Take this! It's a trans-dimensional communication device. You know, so we can keep in touch. Thanks for saving me! 
and the world. I had a blast. Me too. So long, little buddy. Fluffy Bun Bun Show needs is Flux Wildly. Yes! Well, well, Blank. You're early. What happened to you? Pulled an all nighter, Mr. Schmaltz. Hmm. Well, do me a favor. Lose the stubble. Now, let me see those rabbits. Actually, sir, what I'm about to show you is better than bunnies. Better than bunnies? Mm -hmm. What the hell are you talking about? I'm talking about Flux Wildly! Flux what? Wildly, sir. Flux Wildly. This little guy is just the revitalizing shot in the arm you yourself suggested the Fluffy Show needs. Although I think Flux would probably describe it more as a kick up the old wazoo. See, sir? Flux is wacky. He's sarcastic. He's playful. He'll be the lord of Fluffy's Hardy, the Costello to Fluffy's Abbott, the yin to Fluffy's Yang. <laughs> Fox and Fluffy, Laurel and Hardy, yin and yang. Yin, yang, blank. I've been patient with your little lapses, but this, this is inexcusable. Are you single-handedly trying to destroy everything Fluffy has built for us over the last 10 years? Well, are you? No, 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 sir. <laughs> then I suggest you do what I told you to do. Produce the biggest bushy-tailed batch of cute, cuddly bunnies ever rendered by first thing tomorrow morning. Or else you'll find that it will be you who gets the kick of the old wazoo. Yes. Thank you, sir. Sorry, buddy. I tried. I really tried. I wish there was some way I could make it up to you. Thanks to Nefarious' Mutagen Inc. That's not gonna be a problem. It isn't? 